Hi, my name is Jin, and today I want to show you the easiest technique to change the hamburger menu on Elementor. So right now, you can see the result. I change the hamburger menu to another style, and when you click, it show the glow text here. So that different from the default of the hamburger menu Elementor. So let do it together I am right now in the back end of the website and here is the front end of the website uh, so before doing anything I want to show you two plugins that will help me today uh, the first one is the HVZ support that will be help me to install or uh, import the uh, image with the SVG file. Uh, if you use the PNG, uh, you don't need to install this one. And another one is Simple Custom CSS and JavaScript. This will help me to add the CSS code to the website. Of course, you can use another plugin that you like. It doesn't matter. Uh, so, but I will use two plugin today to help me for the tutorial. Okay, so I come back to the front end. So right now we will resize the 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 browser to make it smaller to show the hamburger menu right here. Uh, so first we will inspect the hamburger menu. Inspect, and you can see right now we have before. So that means like. The hamburger icon right here and you can see right now I have the menu dot SVG this is the SVG file I will use to um, change the hamburger menu uh, so I come back to the back end and I go to the media right now I will upload the menu right here so I have the menu picture right here just click the picture and copy the link file URL here I just copy and then I come back to the front end right now if you don't know we can inspect again and then we click the drop down here click to the before and right here we had the content so click here and then we just change a little bit URL and then copy the link inside here you see this menu hamburger is disappear so we have to make it appear again by this new play block and then we need the side with uh, I think 60 pixels oh that's right and you can change the height uh, for me is maybe 15 pixels um, I think it should be 25 pixels 24 25 is fine uh, 25 pixels is really good for me right now and you can see that right now we have the brand new hamburger menu by the FPZ file why I use the FPZ file because the FPZ image is the canvas so you can resize whatever you want but you don't see any pixel in the picture so that I recommend you to use um, so after that when you click the hamburger menu you see the glow button is the X right here is not gonna look good it's not gonna make sense so you after you click the hamburger menu you notice it's right here it will be show up on the top of the hamburger menu you can notice that you see it's right here and this is the code uh, to show the X here um, but I want to change it to be the text so let's see I want to make it close by this one see right now we have the tag is saying close uh, but I think the front is the front of the tag is not make sense so let me in 
inspect this one and I can check is the font is you for Roboto font so I copy this copy this uh, you can comment C comment V I just copy that one copy and then come back to the glow button here I just inspect again uh, go to before you see the glow button here I'm oh, sorry glow here so we click another line and say font family okay from families and we paste the font here so right now you see the font is changed to the Roboto and then we need this font ways to make it look better maybe 3 300 pixel is good one so uh, of course you can change the glow button by another picture as you want like if you have idea to make the glow button with another picture or another method uh, but I want to show you two way like you can add the text and you can add the picture so for the that one when you finish okay so when you finish first let's see so when you finish in the hamburger menu you can copy this you can copy the code here copy and come back here so in right here when you come back here just close this one and then you click to the okay custom CSS and JavaScript the plugin I just recommend and we add the CSS code so on the title we just name anything you like uh, we name mobile menu and then remove this and then we paste this one this one is for the hamburger menu and then when we come back here we click again it show the glow here uh, the glow button here so we copy again we can copy again copy come back here and put it under here so we have the glow button we have the hamburger button and then we click public okay so after public we come back here refresh the website right now we have the brand new hamburger menu so this is the easiest way so you can change the hamburger menu on the elementor I hope this tutorial is helpful for you and and really useful for if you want to change the design or you want uh, the creative menu as you want um, as you want sorry um, of course like we have the CSS custom menu but this is the easiest technique uh, to change the hamburger menu on the Elementor so thank you and see you in the next video